Lee, thanks for joining us on the MTD CNC Technical Corners. Um, as we've said before, you know, we, we go through a great journey of Starag uh, from very uh, complex parts, very, very small parts like medical and jewellery parts up to huge aerospace and oil and gas um, products that you actually supply into the marketplace of machines. So what I want to focus on today is the multifunctional optimized machining, i.e. planetary wheel carrier. Um, now, I, I've seen that Starag's new hack at T45 machine, uh, uh, has, and it's a, a lot of machines with a small footprint, basically. Um, but what's the target market for it? You're absolutely right, Mark. Um, after listening to customers, one criteria with this machine is to reduce the, the floor space. So a small footprint machine, but without any, any compromise on, on stiffness and rigidity. So the Hecat T45 is a twin pallet, heavy duty turn mill. It's a five axis machine with a HSK T100 spindle. And we're looking for turn milled components in the transport and industrial sectors and also aerospace sector made from cast iron, steel or, or even more exotic alloys. Or we can even cut aluminium on this because we've got 15,000 revs. Oh, that's that's. I mean, that makes it so flexible, doesn't it? With, with, with regards to the materials that you can actually use on this. But excuse my ignorance. Uh, as you know, I'm not an engineer. But um, the component you're discussing, a planetary uh, wheel carry. But what is it? Well, this is this is a this is a customer's product. It's sometimes known as a planetary gear carrier or a wheel carrier, but it's the same thing. Um, it's a precise component, and it connects the centre of two gears. And it rotates to carry one gear around the other, a bit like planets around the sun. So normally this type of product would be produced using, say, five different machines, some of which are duplicated because of uh, customer volumes. And all this causes lots of logistic issues um, and throughput issues. So what Starag have come up with is uh, to combine two Hecat T45 machines into a cell with a robot. Um, and this Two machine cell does the same amount of work as nine machines using traditional methods so a massive saving mark massive saving. yeah that, that's incredible isn't it uh, using automation uh, uh you know to to give you you know that that, that sort of uh saving but you, you you say the um how do you quantify this then lee well well you need you need to break the savings down mark so um in this particular case that we're talking about the target was 40,000 parts per year and we calculated out when we set out that we needed a 52% less floor space and that the productivity gain per meter was a factor of 2.6. Um, we also reduced the tooling cost by uh, 30% which is uh, obviously a significant ongoing uh, saving for the customer and we also reduced the fixture cost by 50%. Yeah, as I say, that's incredible figures. I mean, uh, it, 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 I suppose it just shows you that uh, obviously Starag, uh, it's, it's a very consultative sale on each machine for the for the, uh, the benefit of the customer. But um, you, you say it's a big gain for the customer, uh, but what, what's the actual um, gain in the machining time, Lee? Well, well, this is where it gets interesting again, Mark, because the, the actual in-cut time is 37% faster um, than, than the conventional approach. But the actual processing time, the throughput time for each part compared to the competitors' five different machines, is uh, is over fifty percent, fifty two percent. So, uh, so that's why we say it's a massive saving. And and could you tell me what's unique about this machine, Lee? Well, small footprint, as we already discussed. Um, it's also got very dynamic movements and a very fast um, tool change and pallet change. It's extremely rigid, thermosymmetrical structure. It's got a very rigid, heavy-duty trunnion compared to what you'll see on other other, other competitors' machines. Um, direct measurement on all axis. As I said earlier, it's a HSK T100, so it's a T, not an A, and the spindle is clamped for uh, for turning. Um, and, and this spindle is very unusual, big spindle on, on a small machine. It's a twin pallet, so the machine never stops cutting. And there's also an environmental package on the machine as standard, which can reduce the running cost by 10,000 a year. And then there are lots of other options for, say, measuring, tool setting, tool storage, coolant, industry four, 
And then, of course, automation, which um, in, in this case was to combine two machines using the robot that handles um, multiple fixtures, multiple setups. So the, the, the whole solution for the customer depends on the project requirements. And, and we build machines and systems that are optimized to suit customers' needs. Yeah, and I've seen that firsthand, uh, Lee, when, when I joined you at uh, the Hecate factory in Germany. I mean, you know, I didn't see one machine that was looked exactly like, uh, you know, another customer's machine. They're very bespoke. But um, you, you still have a great reputation for quality and performance in the marketplace. But um, achieving this level of performance must have been a huge challenge for you guys. Well, we don't usually get asked to solve the easy challenges, Mark, even though that would be nice for a change. Um, so these components are challenging and some of the features took more than one attempt to master. But that's what Starag does and, and that's why we're successful. So our, our objective is, is always to deliver the lowest cost per part for the customer. And because of this, most customers have more than one Starag machine. Yeah, and I, I know firsthand that you have the, these machines installed in the UK. Um, but, um, you know, finally, Lee, would you or could you summarise the, the benefits of the T45 or the unique selling points of it? Well, it's lowest cost per part, as I just said, always. Um, and, and precision is, is, is a given in that. Um, very rigid machines that allow large cuts and thus reduce machining time. Um, single setup machining with two pallets as a standard, plus the options to automate, so production is, is continuous. Um, really important is decades of know-how and applications experience that we share directly with our customers. Uh, to keep machines running 24-7 um, service and spare parts centers, and also we offer fixed cost service contracts with a 95% availability package. We wrap all this well, up with a, with, wow. a with, with a kind of partnership approach, Mark, with our customers. We, we don't tell people what to do. We really engage, understand the requirements and try and deliver something that's right. Yeah, and I, I've seen this, obviously, uh, join, joining you with some customers in the past. You know, you're very much taking that, you know, there's the part. How, how can I how can I maximize the spindle time, you know, reduce costs? And, you know, when you walk around all the factories that you have in the Starac group, you know, I see this philosophy. And, and I love the strap line that you actually use, engineering precisely what you value. You know, it, it's an incredible journey, uh, you know, on the planetary wheel carrier. Thanks very much for the education on that today, Lee. Uh, it's been a great insight into Starag and a, a different uh, type of machine, the Hecate T45. Thank you, Mark. 